Okay, so we are revising uh, powers, indices, for MYP5 uh, Unit 1, and this is Chapter 3, talking about negative powers. So the best way to approach this is to think of a pattern. 5 to the power of 3 is 5 times 5 times 5. 5 to the power of 2 is 5 times 5. 5 to the power of 1 is just 5. And you can see how you go down each line dividing by 5 each time. Now for that pattern to continue, then the next one would have to be 5 to the power of 0 is 1, because divide the previous 5 by 5, you get 1. Um, and that gives us one of our uh, important rules of powers, that anything to the power of 0 is 1. So I could have started with 17 there. Uh, 17 to the power of 3 would have been 17 times 17 times 17, and then to get 17 to the power of 2, divide that by 17, and it would all have boiled down to uh, 17 to the power of 0 equals 1. So anything to the power of 0 is 1, but then we take that a step further, and the next one for that pattern to continue should be 5 to the power of minus 1 equals 1 divided by 5, which is a fifth and then divide that by 5 again to get the next one. So the next one in the pattern should be that 5 to the power of minus 2 is equal to 1 over 5 squared. So the general rule is that something to a minus power is 1 over the corresponding positive power. x to the minus n equals 1 over x to the n. So for example, 5 to the power of minus 2 is the same as 1 over 5 to the power of 2. Common mistake there is to think that a minus power should mean a minus number, but that's not the case. Okay, so just remember that a minus power, a negative power, means 1 over the corresponding positive power.